Hey everybody, it's BC here and welcome to another episode of Captain of Industry. And I kind of have things paused at the moment because uh, we have a bit of an issue. We're almost out of oil. We're dangerously low on oil and uh, we have to do something about that. Uh, there's a few things I've done after the last episode. I have done a, some research. I can't remember everything I did, but I'm pretty sure one of them I did do was uh, upgrade the cargo depots. I did actually look... Uh, Figured this out a little bit more. This is the the small version. It has two, and that means it has two slots. Or if I upgrade, it'll go up to a four, which means it has four slots. Uh, the ships themselves will actually reconfigure them t themselves to the actual cargo depot. So for instance, for instance, this is uh, two slots. So this will have two slots. If I upgrade this to a four slot, then this should technically have four slots as long as I have four mo modules attached to it. And uh, that's something I actually want to do. I don't actually have concrete at the moment. That's actually something we gotta eventually start working on but uh one of the things i wanted to do uh, actually I'll talk about this i also got uh, another farm set up and i have them rotating on potatoes and vegetables because uh as you can see we have a very big bustling town now and they're out of water Ooh, what's going on here uh we're gonna have to upgrade that uh i think what it is is just not enough wastewater actually leaving so we'll go ahead and upgrade all this since i have the stuff for it and then I have to get the better water set up going. Um, for, as far as research goes, uh, I currently was working on the gas combustion because uh, this is going to be something I want to do today. I want to start getting advanced distillation going so we can get, uh, where is it here? Uh, advanced diesel. Uh, get advanced distillation so we can start producing more fuel out of the oil. Uh, the heavy oil, I looked into this, the heavy oil and the light oil can be burned in in a boiler to make steam which will basically power all the refineries and it's going to be sort of like a closed loop and then what i've done is i've actually looked into the steam turbine this is actually an interesting setup because what i'm going to be doing is all the, the excess steam that comes off of the boilers and uh that doesn't go back into the refinery is going to go over to the high pressure turbines to create mechanical power which in turn generates power so we'll have one turbine will be able to generate me 720 power or 720 kilowatts and i was sort of looking at this and i was noticed that the production level uh the priority is uh, a six on here but on the generators is 11 so apparently what, what's happening is um uh the turbine the, well, yeah, the power generators on the turbine will actually produce power first. Uh, if these can't keep up, then the diesel generators kick in to help keep uh, maintain everything. So it prioritizes the steam over the, the oil, which is good. Uh, a few other things I want to do too, eventually down the road, is this whole area up here. I actually want to set this up into a very large mass of uh, construction part setup. I do have iron over here. We got coal over here, so I can start making the iron. Uh, I'm going to have to go onto the map and start looking for a lumber mill. And I hope you don't see that notification. But uh, somewhere in here, there's going to be a lumber mill. Probably one of these pirate locations. Uh, I could probably go ahead and take care of that guy if I wanted the ship's upgrade ready to go. Uh, but I do kind of want to start upgrading another oil rig while we're at it. So maybe we'll do that. Get that going. We'll run back over here. And we'll start... Uh, Start loading the ship. And that's going to load that up. Now, in the meantime, uh, we also need to start getting some more research done because, as I was saying back in the research tab, uh, a few things I'm doing uh, gas combustion, I need this to recirculate the light oil and heavy oil that we're getting out of the, the refinery and turning that back into steam, which goes back into the system. Uh, and then I got basic distillation to get the, the seawater pump, which is going to help us get uh, another recipe in the basic distiller to make fresh water and then brine. Brine goes into salt. And then we go further on down the line. Uh, I have water uh, mechanical power storage. That's just because we're setting up with the flywheel. I don't think I need it, but I want to get to the water recovery. There's going to be uh, a low steam coming out that we I can recycle back into water. Uh, as far as water goes, I have uh, well, I didn't get that set up yet, but I was going to get into the thermal distillation. But there is a salt production here, which gives me a seawater pump, which is sort of ties into this but it also allows gets me the evaporation ponds which gives us salt and salt in turn gets us glass and glass in turn gets us heavy machinery yes big loophole or not loophole um 
rabbit hole, I guess you could say. Anyway, uh, first of all, let's get the research going. So, uh, to make these, to get the research going, uh, where did I have a tier three? Right here. No, it wasn't. Uh, I thought I had a tier three factory set up. I guess not, but if we go here, uh, that's not what I want to do. I want to go here and that's what I want. We want lab equipment, tier two lab equipment. I already have the tier one lab equipment. We need liquid nitrogen. Liquid nitrogen is very simple. We take the excess nitrogen we're getting off of the air separator, run it through steel and we get liquid nitrogen. I don't know how we get liquid nitrogen out of that, but it seems to work. And so we are going to get that set up over here. I do have to get a chemical plant and the chemical plant requires tier threes. We have tier threes. And let's see here. We can also make fertilizer in this. Now I wanna I think we'll actually get this set up right where do I want to get this set up? We got steel here. Maybe Maybe it would be best to set it up here. I think what would be the best place to put it. I don't know how much we need, but put it right here. I want to keep it close to the nitrogen. Alright, let me go ahead and we get a... Uh, by the way, I have upgraded... Uh, which one is it? This conveyor here. Because it wasn't keeping up with the slag. I had to reroute some of the slag down this way over to make it for the concrete production. And uh, as you can see, we've done a few more cuts in the mine. It, we are definitely digging deep into that. I'm going to have to keep going and see how much we can get. Uh, this is sort of held up right now because we've got to do more, produce more things. Anyway, so for this, let's see what we need here. I think all we need is... Of course, it has to be that way. Let's rotate this then. It'd be nice if you could actually rotate buildings that aren't already built. Alright, so we need a uh, chemical plant. Now, yeah, so how the sour water stripper too. We get the sour water from the distillation plant as well. And that's actually going to help us get a sulfur and ammonia. And ammonia goes into... I believe that was going into fertilizer. Oh, that's not it. Uh, ammonia. Ammonia goes into fertilizer, yes, which we'll probably end up using on the farms eventually. So many things to do, just not enough time to do it. Well, plenty of time to do it, just gotta find the time for it. Alright. And I think I'm gonna branch off after this T-junction here. Uh, we want flat conveyor. Yeah, we'll do it. I'll do it level two. Alright, and like so. Now we go over here, and let's get rid of that. Let's actually pause that for now. I might leave that on just to, um, just to vent if we ever build build up. Okay, and I'm just gonna hastily do this just because that works. All right, uh, another thing I was actually researching too, and this is what we need the re tier three research station for, is uh, the large storage. Uh, the tier two storage has 360 storage. This is 2160. So it's huge amount. It's definitely gonna be good for the upgrades. All right, so that's gonna get us our steel and uh, let's see what we want with liquid nitrogen. Okay. And then it's just a matter of uh, outputting it. Now this is actually an item form. There you go go here and tie it in over here so let me get this set up and I'll be right back yeah well while I, while I make some room for the the research lab I'm actually gonna place them here uh, I was talking about upgrading this we do have a fair number of workers but I was having food problems and it wasn't that I didn't have the food I just didn't couldn't get the food into the storage fast enough so I ended up having to upgrade all this to tier 2 so that is working uh, I'm waiting on the trucks I don't know why they're taking so long but uh, let me do this and I'll be back Okay, off we go. So everything is going. Uh, trucks are very busy. O oil pump is finally out of oil. So what we're going to do, let's see, see if this is done loading yet. Uh, no, it is not. It's still loading. Uh, does it even tell me where? No, 40 more to go. I believe. No. Anyway, uh, so that is done. Let's go ahead and uh, upgrade these. Do a quick delivery on that. Oh, we can't. 
Oh, we're gonna have to go to the... Actually, I don't have to go all the way over there. I can just go here. Let's go and trade for some concrete, shall we? Nothing there. I need this guy. Got plenty of wood. Okay, and then we go back here. And we quick deliver that. Now, I want to see what goes on with this. Let's see how this goes. Are you stuck? You are. No, you're not. Aha, so it does do four. So now, if we go to cargo, and let's put a medium fluid module here. This going the right way. I guess it all goes one way. Now, what does that do to here? This. I've been using the quick delivery quite often. I have unity. I must well be spending it. So, what happens with this ship? I have no idea. We shall find out soon. All right. So these guys are done. Let's go ahead and take these out. Um, uh, yeah. Do uh, that. And how are we doing here? This is slowly working. Alright, well, let me get this done and I'll be back. While we're waiting, the cargo ship is all ready to go, so let's go and... Not enough crew. Oh, yeah. We gotta crew this bad boy up. Because I have not did the modifications. So, let's go ahead and deliver the cargo. He's gonna do its thing. Uh, has this done anything yet? There it is. Okay, so it's only gonna hold 220 of each. But this actually holds 440, so it's got time to dump. Alright, so that is good. Another thing we can do too, maybe, is we can look at upgrading this. I have to probably have to send another ship over there to do that. Alright, now, let's get into this distillation, shall we? So, there's uh, two steps to this. There's going to be a distillation st stage one. This gets us... Uh, we take 18 oil and 3 steam, we get 16 medium oil, 2 heavy oil, and 2 sour water. The medium oil goes into the medium distillation st t stage 2, which get, which now needs 2 steam and produces 12 diesel and the light oil. The light oil has to go through um, the gas combustor, right? Com gas combustion. You know what? Let me finish up this research. Okay, I'm back. I had to set up a storage here to start building up supplies so I could finish these up, and now everything is running. I believe the ship is ready to go. Now let's go over here, and we upgrade. Now, who is making noise here? I have no idea. Anyway, uh, why are you guys still not deconstructing? Alright, so the gas combustion is done, so now we're working in basic desalination. Okay, let's get this out of the way. Come on, let's remove this stuff, guys. Okay, like so. Alright, now, um, what we can do, maybe... Oh, we gotta, send the, we gotta send the ship back home first, and then we'll go explore some of these other places. Uh, ooh, lots of stuff to remove here. Get rid of all this stuff, all these tiny little pieces here. And, okay, so now I want to get uh, big holdings, uh, big holding areas set up. I do have these tanks here, but I want to try to get like a big section here. I do have another pipe come from the other side over there, so I'll put that here. Let's go ahead and hit the right buttons and go to the right spot, of course. Go to food storage. And let's go ahead and put a whole bunch in here. Two, three, four, five, and six should, should do. All right, so now uh, let's get into the refiner. Oh, the refinery. So we need oil and steam. We're getting steam from in here, yes. The boiler. Uh, the boiler. There's not much I can do, so we'll have to use a, a cold generator for this. It produces 8 steam in 10 seconds. 
Uh, I have looked at what I need for both distillers, and it's actually five every 20, so one of these should actually be able to fuel three. And then once I get the heavy and light oil going back through here, it should produce back into steam. All right, so let's uh, get this hooked up. Let's start with this st distillation st stage one. Let's see where my outputs are. Uh, hmm. Okay, oil and steam. This side, sour water out that side, oil there. Ooh. This is going to be an interesting one. Let me work this out and I'll be back. Okay, I am back. Uh, as you can see, I decided to uh, uh, double up the operation a little bit. I decided to add uh, three more sets of distilleries to uh, try to really ramp up production. I do have the sour water stripper all set up. I have conveyors bringing the sulfur over to here, which I do have to actually set. Uh, for the time being, I'm actually going to pause the construction of these ones. This is just going to be uh, uh, temporary storage for now, because uh, it's going to be going to fertilizer down the road. Uh, everything here is set up. i got the ammonia there, water, and all that stuff. I also do have sort of a feedback loop getting the steam going back into uh, this, this steam line here to try to relieve the pressure on these we'll see how that goes i was gonna set up a coal line going up to here but we'll wait on that uh, i hope i do have enough materials this time i have 1200 and they're looking about 30 a piece right now uh these are actually 50 but i do have production still going uh, we're actually officially out of oil so what i'm going to do is i'm actually going to go ahead and pause the rubber maker for the time being that we do have rubber but uh, we don't really need it except for the construction materials which uh well, not those ones in here somewhere yes here rubber which goes through here but we have a surplus uh, I had a bit of an issue too where was that one uh, oh yeah I noticed uh, some trucks here can't actually go anywhere and what I discovered I toggle the overlay uh, when I built the research labs I didn't actually give them that one block space now there is technically space, but I guess it needs a one block space driving area around conveyors and buildings and all that stuff. So, yeah, I've got this on a uh, quick removal, but I need trucks for it, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, as far as other trucks I can steal, maybe. Uh, where is the. Where are the tree harvesters? That's a good question. Oh, wait, what are you? Oh, yeah, you're wood. Hmm. Well, let's uh, fire it up and see what happens. See what we can do here. We do have trucks. These guys have nowhere to deliver their cargo. Same with these guys and all that stuff. Let's actually speed it up. See if I can... Like, normally I can do a quick deconstruct, but... Like, I can do a quick removal here, but I can't do it here. And unfortunately, that silo is what's actually in the way. And I can't... Oh, I can actually do that. That works. I'll be right back. Okay, so uh, I am back. I do hear the ship is back, which means that our oil rig should be upgraded. Uh, so it should be a tier 4, right? Oh, maybe not. Do I still need to load the materials? I thought I already loaded it. Uh, no, I didn't. Uh, let's actually worry about this first. Uh, as you can see, they've already started. So, uh, I'm hoping everything holds up, like the fuel situation. I still do have these running. No, I don't. Missing input. Oh, yeah, I'm out of oil. Uh, you're unloading, though. No. Uh, let's actually... Go ahead and quick deliver this stuff so I can keep the oil producing. And it's actually where the unity comes in really handy. I have been spending a lot, but I'm mean, get gaining a lot. And I am using a lot. So uh, that'll do that. And that should get some oil going back into the system. Here. Fact, what I should be doing. Oh, it already is. Okay, good, you're filling up. Alright, so now, 
I'm going to do what I did last time. I'm going to speed this up and we'll see how it goes. I'm going to see if I can grab a few more trucks too. Maybe I'll quick produce a few. Okay, I'm back and uh, the, the time lapse didn't work out too well. For some reason, they started filling these up and then they were getting stuck over here because they forgot to put a ramp here and there's a pipe in the way so they couldn't drive over and deliver the oil to, to here. And as you can see, we're already starting to get a bit of a lack of materials but uh, things are slowly going I had to pause the tier 3 construction materials just to nope, uh, just to keep these going uh, I can't get these going any faster right now really uh, concrete is moving so that is actually a good thing I was actually worried about that but we are just about done just a few more things to go uh, I could probably start quick delivering some of this maybe not uh, that was actually another issue I had too. I had people starting to work here before actually building the rest of it, so I ran out of workers. And you know, when you're in that photo mode, you don't see any of these notifications. This is all you see. So, anyways, uh, this is almost done. Uh, what we can do is uh, let's see what's going on here. There's actually nothing in here. Uh, there's nothing in you. Let's actually go check on the map while we're waiting. Okay. Oh, uh, we actually still have to upgrade that one. What's going on here? This one is still going, okay. So maybe what we'll do while we wait is... Let's pick one of these pirates to go deal with. We'll check over here. While we're waiting, maybe we'll find that lumber mill. That'd be nice. Uh, yeah, I had to pause rubber production too, just, just to be on the safe side, I think. Yeah, I've still got some materials left. Uh, we are almost done this, so it's not going to be that big of an issue. i really like to be able to quick complete that, but uh, it is getting there. Uh, what else can we do? Um, how the, how's the food situation doing? Food's doing good, workers are doing good. This is full, so let's go ahead and pause that, because we don't actually need that. We'll get another worker out of it. Uh, let's check on the mines. Mines are still mining, everything's still rolling. And research is being, has been done. Uh, yeah, as you can see, not enough fuel because I am waiting because there are... Oh, maybe not. Ship in battle. And let's see. We're going to win. Victory. And we get... Hey, we found a sulfur mine. Hooray. Just as we build a uh, um, sour water stripper. All right, we'll go head back home, and let's see how we're doing here. This is doing good. Again, no workers. I don't care, as I just want to get the rest of this all built. Uh, maybe what we should do while we're waiting, because I believe it should be too expensive. Let's see, housing and services. Oh, of course. Of course. We need more workers. What's going on here? Oh yeah, don't know the connector, I don't even know why that's showing up. Okay, we have water recovery next. Let's actually see what we had for research. Cargo Depot 2, that's already been done. Uh, that's all going. Uh, what I'll do is I'll bring you back when this is all finished. Okay, they are firing up. That is awesome. We'll get this one going. And no workers, uh oh. Uh, actually what I could do. Don't need these guys, let's pause these. Take the workers from here. Come on guys, you're gonna go get another job. Go over here. And... Now I'm short on oil. We shall see how this goes, I guess. Uh, yeah, uh, let me take care of this, we'll be back. Actually, what we can do is, uh, he's bringing some oil in now. Go ahead and upgrade this. We'll quick deliver as soon as I buy some more cinder blocks. Okay, and then we'll go ahead and quick deliver that. Upgrade you. We're going to get rid of the loose storage, because I don't actually need it right now. Get rid of you. Uh, oh, the truck's already here. And... And we're going to put four more fluid modules on here. Nope, we're going to put the large ones. Come on, get out of there. And 
playing the same thing. We're going to hook these all up with pipe. And hopefully, uh, next time that ship comes back, he's going to have a lot of oil. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Excuse me. I'll connect you up there. Like so, and like this, so. And I need workers. Which means I should be able to actually have enough to produce or build another housing too. I should build two more. Quick delivery to you because we need more people here. Fire you back up. And then uh, I was going to load up the ship to go over, refill that oil rig, uh, upgrade that oil rig, but it is already done. So let's go pick another spot. I have another cargo ship there, I don't really need it. Let's go up here. Ship battle of 70. Have a look at that. And... Yeah, we're gonna need so many more workers. Not enough workers, not enough fuel, not enough anything. Oh my god, the fuel station is out of fuel. Ugh. Alright, I'll be back when I get this everything all uh, worked out here. Okay, we just had another battle, and... Oh, I found the sawmill, exactly what I was looking for. That was cool. Hooray! Alright, head back home, and I think we're going to go look at uh, repairing this thing too, eventually. Uh, I had to build the ramp because he was trying to deliver water, but he can't get there because, you know, there's no way to get to it. And, oh, what do you know? What do you know? There's actually no way to drive there. That was a fine place for it. Let's see if we can redo this. Okay, I am back, and everything is up and running. Now, why are these guys actually producing power? They shouldn't be. Oh, probably these guys aren't getting enough steam. Yeah, I might have to get a second generator, because it seems we, we, we seem to be producing more light oil than heavy oil. Uh, things are still sort of catching up. Uh, we do have some oil in these tanks here, which are going to these refineries. I think I'm actually going to reverse the direction of this and get this pumping back into... This system over here. That should be coming out, right? Uh, no, I am missing a pipe. And that goes over here, and... Yes, that should be... Should be going through. Why is it not going in? Something's not right here. Hang on. I figured it out that's actually an input on this side so I gotta just quickly connect the pipe over to here like so and then we'll uh, just leave that direction reversed and these should actually drain out should oh yeah as soon as, as soon as this is done we'll finish that but as you can see we're getting a nice surplus of diesel coming up so that is good and there it goes. Okay, it's draining back over to here. As long as we keep this going, these should keep going. Uh, as far as everything else, uh, let's go check the map here. Um, let's see what's going on here. Uh, I do have to get materials in there. Oh, we can actually load up the ship. Let's go ahead and start loading the ship. And we'll go f finish up that oil rig, and while we're at it, let's go have a look at that sawmill. What we need to fit, repair that, 150. Okay, uh, that is uh, not too bad. What is your problem? There's a truck here that can't go so anywhere. Oh, you. Now, why are you delivering over there? I have no idea. Oh, I guess we're going to have to put another ramp in. Quick deliver that. Oh my god, we actually have concrete. Wow. Alright, and we got a nice surplus of sulfur. Uh, I'm thinking about setting up a flare to deal with this uh, eventually. Uh, but what we can do is we do have tier 3 storage. We should. Hang on a second, where is it? Storage. Tier 1, tier 2, tier 3. Oh, can I not? Oh. Oh, okay, that's going to be... Uh, kind of interesting. I thought I was going to be able to upgrade all these, but apparently that's not the case. And ship is loaded, ready to go. Alright, let's go send it on the way. So we're going to do... Oh, 
Were we upgrading the oil rig? Yes, we were. Alright, uh, that's going to do that. That, let's see how the research is doing. I had to... We had to pause it, yes. No, I didn't. I paused this. Which I gotta continue on because we're actually running out of nitrogen. Now, I've just thought about what I'm gonna do here. Uh, it's not really the that we're out of nitrogen, but we're full on oxygen. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a second storage. I'm gonna just put it like... So I guess, actually, let's move it out of the way so the trucks can actually get to it if they need to. And we'll just do like that. We'll grab a pipe. Just here. Don't need a big pipe. Just a small pipe like so. And then I'm going to put a flare on there. Is that a flare? No, we'll just put a smokestack. Okay. Finish you. Finish you. Like so. And then you. Now what's going to happen is... No, I've got that wrong. Hold on. Okay, that's what I gotta do. I gotta branch it off before the tank, so that way it fills up this tank and this tank at the same time too. Then it's gonna void all the... Well, it's gonna fill up both tanks, but you know what I mean. And that way it just keeps production here, and that's what I want. Let's go ahead and speed this up, because I gotta get this research finished. And, again, that's what Unity is for. How are we doing on population here? Oh, we still got lots of room. It's good because we need lots of employees. So now you are actually producing nitrogen. Good. Which is producing liquid nitrogen, which is keeping the steel going, which is keeping everything else going, and it is also getting us tier 3 construction materials and research. And uh, unpause you. And continue on. Now, is this thing actually there? It is. Oh wait, we can keep upgrading them. Oh, that's interesting. I should have upgraded this one then. Well, in that case, maybe... Let's head back. Go back here. And we'll upgrade this one. Start loading loading up the ship there and bring you back when I'm done. Okay, I am back and once again we have worker shortage. So let's see what, where we can get these uh, extra employees from. Oh, the flares actually do need work. So what I've done is I put uh, some tanks on uh, on an extra, extra tanks on the light and heavy oil because I was filling up on the light oil and it was sort of halting production here so I had to branch off to a second tank to flare off like I did with the nitrogen. Uh, I need employees. You have... Let's actually pause the research. That'll get us our workers. Because I need workers for these things, and I need workers for all the other stuff that I just built. Uh, but the ship is on its way back, and I think... Actually, it's not on the way back, but I think we can go explore. And go explore over here, just because we can. And the reason why we're doing that is that we can actually get more uh, employees. And where are you? Oh, yeah. Uh, it's just the wood thing. Wait. Why can you not reach your destination? Are you stuck or something? You gotta run up there and there. Hmm. I have a feeling you guys are stuck. The other guys can move. Anyway, that's what the again what Unity is for. All right, we are exploring the other place. After this exploration, I think we'll call this episode here because we're chugging along and with pirate battle over two ships. So. We got 17 people, rubber and copper. Let's go home and we got to repair this bad boy. But I think we're going to call this episode here. We managed to get a substantial oil refining process going. I have upgraded, I've upgraded this oil rig here. 
So this is level five. I got a four times production. Uh, same with this one over here. That's why I'm short on workers. I need workers for here. So these are both level four, I believe. Yes, they are. So they are producing. 36 every 20, it was 18 before, so they're doubling production, which is good because now I got the ships going to fill up and I started filling these up pretty quick. Or not those, but anyways, in here. And yeah, so I think I, think, uh, I thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to leave me a like, and as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later. Later. Awesome.